right, we have some breaking inputs now coming in. Union Minister Anurag Thakur has reacted and attacked Rahul Gandhi on his Lord Ram comments. Anurag Thakur has said that people who walk with Tukle Tukle gang are now talking about Lord Ram. This was when he was addressing the press. Uh, remember, Anurag Thakur had earlier also uh, attacked Rahul Gandhi, saying that uh, the person is not dedicated to the ongoing uh, election campaigning and, and that if, it, if he was dedicated to what is happening in the country, he would have participated in the election campaigning itself. And the recent remark that now the union minister has passed is that Rahul Gandhi has no right to talk about Lord Ram or Sita because people who work with Tukde Tukde gang are now talking about Lord Ram. Clearly, Anurag Thakur is taking a dig at uh, actors like Swara Bhaskar who have accompanied Rahul Gandhi in his walk uh, during the time when it entered the state of Madhya Pradesh. Let's also listen in to what Anurag Thakur has to say. Rahul Ji, where Ram Ji has reached, it's true. In the journey of the gang, the gang of the gang of the gang, who talk about Hindu atankwad, जिनको तुष्टिकरण की राजनीति करने की आदत पड़ गई हो चुनाव आते उनको भी राम याद आए all right, and clearly taking a dig uh, at Rahul Gandhi and his political stance at the moment, Anurag Thakur went on to also say that this is only when election is nearby that uh, Rahul Gandhi is remembering Lord Ram. Let's quickly go across to our political editor Pallavi Ghosh, who's on the phone line with me. Pallavi, uh, important to put this into perspective in terms of how uh, now the BJP is only milking this to their advantage by projecting Rahul Gandhi's uh, image as anti-Hindutva or someone who's only using the Hindutva card when elections are around the corner. Yeah, that's right. So the BJP always makes a point that he's a Chunavi Hindu and it's only when there are elections around the corner or when they want to make a political point is suddenly you find Rahul Gandhi going to temples. Now what Rahul Gandhi was essentially trying to say and do was to show that an RSS-backed BJP is uh, is no one to talk about women empowerment because when you say Jai Shri Ram, you do not give the place which you should be giving to Sita. And if you listen to the words of Rahul Gandhi, he was making the point that the RSS has no space for women. And that's the reason neither the BJP nor the RSS leaders will ever say Jai Sia Ram. Of course, that has evoked, as expected, very, very strong reactions from the BJP. They've been making two points. One, the Bharat Jodo Yatra is taking along people who are anti-development or what they call the Tukre Tukre guy. And the second important thing is that why is it that he has different yastics for different states he's going through. In Kerala, he meets a pastor who is considered to be anti-India. But when he goes to uh, the BJP bastions or northern Indian states like Madhya Pradesh and UP later on, he's going to be indulging in Hindutva, Hinduism or temple hopping. Absolutely. Also, we've heard Anurag Thakur also uh, attack Rahul Gandhi's uh, when it comes to election campaigning, even during the time when election campaigning for Himachal Pradesh was uh, taking place. We saw him make a direct attack at Rahul Gandhi, saying that why has he not actively campaigned for a state like uh, Himachal Pradesh and why is he busy taking the yatra through uh, states which don't even matter for the country at the moment? I mean, uh, well, Rahul Gandhi's been is very clear from the beginning that he's going to be a part of the Bharat Joro Yatra and it's got nothing to do with politics. Uh, he's taking up the Yatra for a particular reason. That's because he feels that the country needs to be united and therefore he's traveling from Kanyakumari to Kashmir to make this point. Uh, the BJP, of course, has always been saying the kind of people he's associating with during the Yatra just goes on to show, one, the purpose is political and it's but he doesn't even understand that these people are against the idea of one India. And uh, also bang in the middle of the Gujarat election, Rahul Gandhi having Mera Patkar as a part mm. of the Yatra was used by the Prime Minister himself. So, you know, I think this kind of a confrontation between both the sides will continue whether or whether there is no election. Many thanks to you, Pallavi, for putting that into perspective for us. And with that, let's also play out the kind of political reactions that this entire controversy has garnered. वो वास्तविक जो हिंदुत्व जानता है वैसे आजकल वो मंदिर मंदिर घूम रहे हैं खुद को साधु का वेश लगाकर वो घूम रहे हैं ये हिंदुओं का एक तरफ से उन्होंने अपमान किया है तो पहले माता लक्ष्मी को लगाकर पहले माँ को लगाकर ही फिर पुरुष का नाम लेते हैं इसलिए श्री सुनील देवधर होता है तो हिंदू समाज ये जानता है नहीं जाना जानता है तो जाने लेकिन राहुल गांधी को 
ये जो भारत जोड़ो यात्रा के नाम पर निकले है ये वास्तविक में किस तरह से समाज तोड़ो यात्रा है वो क्यों नहीं इस तरह का बयान देंगे उन्हीं के पिताजी जब इस देश के प्रधानमंत्री थे उन्होंने बगैर मुस्लिम साइट को बताए उन्होंने बाबरी मस्जिद का ताला खुलवा दिया और वहां पर शिलान्यास कराना शुरू करा दिया और नेहरू के बाद उनका जो नवा उनका जो नवासा था राज, रा, राजीव गांधी उन्होंने ताले खुलवा दिए जब बाबरी मस्जिद को शहीद किया गया नरसिम्हा राव कांग्रेस के प्रधानमंत्री थे वही तो बोलेंगे बात और कौन बोलेगा नहीं दुखद है इस प्रकार की बयानबाजी को बिल्कुल स्वीकार नहीं किया जा सकता सर आज कानून अपना काम कर रहा है और इस प्रकार के हम लोगों को बयानबाजी से बचना चाहिए सार्वजनिक जीवन में हमको सबको साथ लेकर के किसी की भावनाओं को ठेस नहीं पहुंचाना चाहिए कि वो उनका मामला है उनके मतलब जिभ्या पर माता सरस्वती कहाँ चली गई वो जाने लेकिन ये दुखद है राजनीति में शुचिता का शब्दों पर नियंत्रण रखना चाहिए राहुल गांधी जी से बीजेपी को कोई सर्टिफिकेट नहीं चाहिए भारतीय जनता पार्टी जान रही है कि जो लोग नकली हिंदू बन रहे हैं जो लोग चुनाव के वक्त में मंदिर जाते हैं वोट के लिए मंदिर जाते हैं वो बीजेपी को संदेश देने का और बीजेपी को कोई अपनी तरफ से एक बिना वजह के सलाह देने का जरूरत नहीं है भारतीय जनता पार्टी के जो कार्यकर्ता हैं उनके बारे में जो समाज की छवि समाज में जो छवि बनी है और कांग्रेस की क्या छवि है ये पूरा देश जानता है श्री राहुल गांधी जी जिस मुंह से आपने श्री राम जन्मभूमि का विरोध किया जिस मुंह से कांग्रेस ने श्री राम के अस्तित्व को नकारा जिस मुंह से श्री राम सेतु का विरोध किया रामायण को एक कहानी कथा कहकर श्री राम जन्मभूमि के फैसले को रुकवाने की बात की आपके मुंह से ऐसा नहीं जचता ऐसी बातें अपने मुंह से मत कहें क्योंकि आपका और आपकी पार्टी का श्री राम जी के बारे में जो स्टैंड रहा है वो पूरा भारत जानता है कॉमेंट्स मेड बाई और टॉप लीडर राहुल गांधी ऑफ कांग्रेस पार्टी दैट बीजेपी इज इंटरेस्टेड ओनली जय श्री राम नॉट जय सीता राम आर जय सी आर राम पीपल फ्रॉम नॉर्थ इंडिया दे कॉल इट जय सी सी आर राम आर सीता राम डजेंट मैटर वट आवर इट मे बी सी आर राम सीता राम वन एंड सेम सो दैट्स ए क्वेश्चन पोज बाई अवर लीडर वाई आर यू नॉट कॉलिंग जय सीता Are you not interested in Sita?